Hi, what's up guys? How's it going? My name is Boris. I'm PHP developer. Right now I'm located in New Orleans city, Louisiana state. In this video, I'm going to tell you about what's going on in the city. Uh, what am I doing in here? And how am I working while traveling? If you are interested in this, please subscribe to my channel and continue watching this video. And the main reason of uh, recording this video is to say that uh, I finally have started working and right now I'm uh, negotiating with three clients, uh, three clients already and the first client that I would like to uh, talk about is the guy from Canada, actually right now he is in Peru, uh, he has a house over there or something like that. Um, that client demands uh, certain software, so certain server, and that server is going to need to broadcast um, crypto exchanges quotes to, uh, to other applications. So this is some kind of proxy broadcasting server. Uh, it's not that complicated, so you'll need to uh, subscribe to um, different exchanges at the same time. Some of them uh, work through WebSockets, some of them work through uh, API requests, REST API. And you will need to subscribe to all of them and to, bro to, and to broadcast these uh, quotes further. The only uh, important thing um, about this client is that um, that guy from Canada, he demanded um, the, the application to be developed in Node.js. And the only problem is that I don't do Node.js at all. In this case, I'm gonna plug other developers from my team. So this project is going to be developed by another guy from my team. His name is Pavel. The second client is from uh, Germany. His name is Johannes. Uh, as I already told you, uh, he is a very interesting guy. He's a, a crypto trader. So that is his job. He doesn't do other things um, apart from uh, trading cryptocurrencies. And um, his task is to develop uh, the trading bot which is called a spreader so a spreader is a type of uh, trading software uh, which trades two order books at the same time it's not that complicated uh, i used to develop such stuff <laughs> in my experience before that but uh, the main thing that uh, the logic that that, that guy uh, wants to be implemented in his trading software is really complicated <laughs> i spent about three days uh, developing um, the software specification and I think uh, tonight or tomorrow uh, I'll be able to finish uh, that software specification completely so um, the charge is the same 250 or 300 dollars but I think I will need to charge a little bit more so I will need to charge uh, about 500 dollars uh, the third client is located in Australia uh, right now I am about to finish the software specification and pretty soon I'm gonna start coding it's gonna be a simple trading board I would say a classical one it's gonna be developed in PHP and Laravel based on Linux nothing special and uh, yesterday I received from the same client I received uh, an offer he proposed that he needed me to uh, take care of other projects as discovered he is the manager in an agency or something like that and they develop software as well pretty interesting also he gave me uh, the hourly wage uh, he's gonna pay me $25 per hour which is not that much and uh, I believe that from his end he's gonna double the the price at least for his client, he's gonna charge $40 per hour, US dollars. So Australian dollar is a little bit lower than the US dollar. Uh, and it's pretty interesting. I'm pretty excited that uh, such a coincidence uh, may happen. And if finally I will be, I will be able to work it out, uh, I will have enough work for two or three full-time developers. That's pretty good. 